Hello everyone, it's Imran here. Welcome back to another video. So, I'm going to react to, the, to another S1 movie. This one was the newest one that was uploaded two days ago on January 19th. And it's called Goodman's Heart Transplant. Yep. You read the title right there. Goodman's Heart Transplant. So, yeah. The, the last movie I reacted to just now was Cody's Hot Dog Restaurant. And oh my god, that one was just no. That one was just no right there. You do want to see me that out, I'll have it up in the top right corner of your screen. So yeah, Goodman's heart transplant. So Goodman needs a heart transplant. And I've I've seen Chives. I've seen Chives, which is Goodman's butler in the thumbnail. Don't tell me that that Goodman is gonna be is gonna try and get Chives' uh heart so he could get for his transplant right there. Don't tell me that don't tell me that's gonna happen, but Knowing my luck, knowing it's good, man, it's, that's probably what's going to happen. But it could be anyone's heart. It could be Marvin's heart, Brooklyn Guy's heart, Jeffy's heart. We just don't know. We just don't know. Uh, links to the video I'm reacting to in the description down below, as always. So, so I was going to burp there, and I am. Excuse, <laughs> excuse me. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into this. Hey, Danny, look what I found out my lips can do. All right, Jeffy, that's really cool. Stop, Jeffy, the huff do. Hey! Stop it. Marvin, 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 I bought something with your credit card. Don't be mad. What'd you buy? I got myself a Louis Vuitton bag. I've never had one before, oh, Marvin. How much did that cost? Well, it was originally $10,000, but there was a scratch on it, so I got it for $3,000. $3,000? We don't even have that kind of money! Oh, Marvin, please let me keep it. I won't ask for anything else for the rest of the year. Oh my god, we don't have that kind of money. Hey, Marvin, look what I found out my lips can do. <laughs> Stop it, Jeffy! Oh, there's someone at the door. Hello? Marvin, when I uncover my eyes, I better see a fat stack of cash in your hand for your house payment. Yay! Oh. No house payment for me! I don't know what I was expecting! Well, I, I just don't have the money to make my house payment. Marvin, you haven't paid a house payment in six fucking months! How do you eat? Oh. How do you live? How do you do anything? And how the fuck are your lights still on? Well, I can pay those bills because they're, they're not as expensive as the house payment. Bullshit! I'm coming inside right now to look for anything I can pawn to make money for your house payment! Oh, no, 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 no. All right, Marvin, how much do oh. you think I can get for your couch? Please don't sell our couch. We like to sit on it. Yeah, you like to sit on it a little too much. That's why I should sell it, because it'll motivate you to go get a job. Marvin, is he going to sell our stuff? Well, Marvin hasn't made a house payment in six months. What the fuck is that? This is my new Louis Vuitton bag. Marvin got it for me. I know exactly what that is. That's an endangered <laughs> Nile crocodile. She just threw, Rose just threw Marvin under the bus right there. Oh, my God. Goodness. She, Rose actually brought it for herself and she, she's putting the blame on Marvin. Oh my god. No wonder so many people hate Rose because not, not only do, is she very unintelligent, she also. A Louis Vuitton Capucine! An endangered crocodile? I didn't know that! I don't want it anymore! And it cost $30,000! $30,000? I thought it was $3,000! <laughs> $30,000! Marvin, I think I'm having a heart attack! Me uh -oh. too! No, I'm being serious! You have $30,000 to spend on a fucking Louis Vuitton purse, but you don't have money to pay your house payment! Well, I, I didn't mean- I didn't know it was that much! I'm calling ambulance! Uh, I'm having a heart attack! Stop screwing around, Goodman. Get up. I'm calling ambulance. I, I think he might actually be having a heart attack. Oh, well, no. Mr. Goodman, you're very lucky to be alive. We had to resuscitate you 15 times because your heart just didn't want to beat. Well, your heart wouldn't want to beat either if you heard what I heard. Go ahead, tell him, Marvin. My wife bought a $30,000 purse. Oh, oh, I'm having a heart attack, nurse! I got the defibrillator paddles, clear! Oh, oh, thank you, nurse. Yeah, you're right, that the is outrageous heart attack for a ever. purse, no way. And he doesn't even pay his house payments either. Well, look, we have bigger problems. We took an x-ray of your heart, and it turns out your heart is way too small. You have cardiodwarfism. Your heart's the size of a child. Heart. Oh I haven't seen a goodness. heart this small since the Grinch came in for his checkup, and the only reason his heart grew three sizes was because he learned the How is Goodman's heart that small? <sighs> SML's law never fails to dis never fails to surprise True me. meaning of Christmas, but then, the next day, his heart exploded. Well, that doesn't make any sense, because I was doing just fine before I found out Marvin bought a $30,000 purse, you fuck! 
Ow! If, if you don't get a heart transplant, you're gonna die. All right, well then put me on the list. Get the lip. Well, I don't think you understand. People wait years on that list. Okay, well I'm rich, so let me go to the top of the list. I'll pay my way up. But you still need a donor. Sir, sir, I came as soon as I heard the news. Are you crying because you thought I almost died? No, sir, I'm crying because you didn't die. <laughs> oh. Give me his heart, I want his. Sir, he is very old. His heart's probably gonna give out any day now anyway. Okay, go ahead and kill him, get it over with. No, he's not an ideal candidate. All right, well then give me Marvin's heart. He owes me money. No, <laughs> okay, it can't be anybody who's alive. All right, well then give me a gun. No, no, your ideal candidate's probably somebody who's about 19, somebody who's young and healthy. Okay, well what about my gardener? He's Cuban as shit, and he doesn't speak English, so he's not gonna know what you're saying. Just go up to him and say, como se dice Taco Bell, and he'll start hopping. And then he'll get right in the car because he's thinking he's gonna go to Taco Bell. No, no, it has to be somebody who's died recently. If you find me somebody who died in a car accident, I could use their heart. Okay, well... Before I go, there's one more thing I'd like you to take a look at. I have a golf ball sized bump on my wiener. Oh, I can take a look. Oh, oh sweet Jesus, oh that is no. massive. Oh sir, you've been no. blessed by God. Mm -hmm. Wow, but I didn't see a bump. Oh, there's no bump, I just wanted you to see it. Oh. Are you okay? Hi, hi, hi. Come on, Marvin, you have a heart to find why? me. Okay. Marvin, you find me a heart right now. Why me? Because you're the one who caused all this. No, your heart was already small. Marvin, if you don't find me a heart, I swear to God I'm gonna take that $30,000 purse and give it to one of my girlfriends so she can scoop cat shit with it. But I was gonna return it. Okay, then return it and give me the money so Marvin can finally make a house payment. Return the purse. Okay, Marvin, do you think they can turn it back into a crocodile? No, I think he's dead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Marvin, you find me a heart right now. Where all am I right. gonna find a heart? No, I don't know. Me. Chives, get in here! Now speak. What do you want, sir? Good boy. Chives, find me a heart. But I don't know where to find a heart, sir. Spank him! Ow, ow, Oh, oh poor Chives. Chives. Tush. Look, we don't know where to find a heart because the person has to be dead. Hmm, who's someone that I wish they were dead? Me, sir. No, someone else. Your maid, sir? Oh, yes, Quinceanera. Go get her. Very well, sir. You're gonna kill your maid? I'm gonna try to. Did you call for me, Mr. Goodman? Oh, yes, no, I don't want you to woman. breathe anymore. Oh, do you want me to try to be my record? Yes. Okay, let me thank you. No, oh, not in here, not in here. We gotta go in the other room. Oh, okay, see, si, see. Si. Marvin, I'll be right back with a corpse. <laughs> Marvin, I'm in love. I think I'm getting married. Why'd you blow my nose? Because I didn't want you to breathe. Marvin, five minutes and 37 seconds of no air. I think George, you're welcome, Judy, in my lungs. Oh, and I also think she has pneumonia. So go ahead and get ready for the wedding. Okay, thank you. Well, if she's not dead, who's else, who, whose heart are you going to get now? Hmm, who else do I hate? Oh, my son Richard! Chives, go get Richard! Very well, sir. What do you want, Dad? What do your grades look like? Oh, no, D's and no, F's? Richard. That's it. You're done. You're grounded from your heart. What the fuck does that mean? Chives, kill him. How should I kill him, sir? With a guillotine. But, sir, we don't own a guillotine. What the Sorry about that. It's just for the background noise. It was just... I'm trying to record, bub. And buy one! Fine. Wait, before you kill your son, you should make sure he's even a good candidate for his heart, because he is a kid. Okay, well then take him to Mike Snickerpippet's office and see what he thinks. Who's Mike Snickerpippets? The doctor! That's not his name. All right, well then Dr. Snickerpippets! I don't give a fuck, just take him! Come on. Dr. Snickerpippets! The fuck you just call me? Mr. Goodman wants to know if his son's a good candidate oh, for the heart transplant. Guys on no, right he's there. too young and he's still alive. His heart's not gonna be any bigger than Goodman's. No, we need an adult. Dr. Snickerpippets! Why is everyone calling me that? We have a trauma that just came in. A car accident, 78 years old. <sighs> well, Mom, you were in a car accident? I'm a little bit drunk. Well, you shouldn't be drinking and driving. I was on FaceTime. And you shouldn't be on your phone. Oh, I wasn't on my phone. You know your boy Simmons? He was giving me FaceTime. He was looking up my entire oh bowl my of clam God. chowder Simmons with discharge. Guy's like mom. a dog when he sees you when you come home from work. Happy as fuck. Ew, <laughs> ew, my, my mom, stop. Wait, I didn't know my car had a heated tongue oh. to sit on. Mom, you're not even injured. Just go home. Wait, why don't we give her heart to Mr. Goodman? Oh, she doesn't even have a heart. And believe me, if she did, you wouldn't want it. She drinks like a fish and she smokes like a train. A pack a day. Twelve. What? Oh, she upgraded. Okay, well, well, Mr. Goodman still needs a heart. Can I get a heart from here? We're well, not gonna find one here. Well, it's a hospital. Don't they have hearts like in the freezer? No, just go. <sighs> Brookie, what are you doing? You're playing dress up like you're some sort of doctor or something. I am a doctor. It says it right on my shirt. You're not even a real doctor. Your stethoscope is sewn to your stupid shirt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, well, Goodman, the doctor oh, said your son's heart won't work because he's still alive and he's too young. Damn. I sure wish my buddy Jeffrey was still alive. I could just go to his island and pick any heart I want. Marvin, I returned the purse, but they told me the best they could do for me was give me in-store credit. Oh, I feel like I'm having another heart attack. You didn't get the money back. I'm having a really hard day, Marvin. Look, I also ran over this squirrel. Why would you bring a dead squirrel in the house? Oh. Because I felt bad. For it. Ooh, maybe I can use the squirrel's heart, and if it works, that'll be nuts. You can't use a squirrel's heart, it's an animal, and it's too small. Hey, Daddy, can I vote for president this year? Yes, Jeffy, you can oh, vote. You're 19 no, years old. No, not Jeffy. 19 years old. Marvin, how much do you like your son? Eh. I'll give you a million dollars for his heart right now. A million dollars? <laughs> Yeah, she's right. No. Uh, yeah, you, you can't have his heart. Also, I think he has a heart condition. He has tachycardia. All right, Marvin. Well, I can either give you a million dollars for his heart. Oh, Marvin just roasted Jeffy right there, and Jeffy responded in the best way possible. Can't have his heart. Also, I think he has a heart condition. He has tachycardia. All right, Marvin. Well, I can either give you a million dollars for his heart right now, or I can just get it for free tonight if something magically happens to him. Nothing's going to happen to Jeffy. All right, we'll see about that. I think Goodman's going to try to kill Jeffy. I hope not. So, we're on the street. Oh! And you're going to get somebody. Shh. Shh. Got. Yeah, I need you to kill someone. Shh, shh, shh. Hey, man, be quiet. I don't want the police hearing this shit. He's gonna have you even fire. ever killed anybody before? Oh, yeah. You see all these teardrops under my eye? One drop for each person I killed. Okay, so six. Yeah, six. So, oh, no. how do you want me to do it? They better not kill off Jeffy. To death. I don't care how you do it, just don't damage the heart, because I need that. Okay, can I shoot him with a shotgun? I don't care, just don't hit the heart. Hell. And also, if you don't mind, could you cut the heart out for me? Oh, yeah, I, I've done that tons of times. Okay, thank you. Gooper, you goddamn son of a bitch! I thought I told you to clean out the chicken coop! I already did that, Paul! I done told you I scooped all the shit and put it in your garden! Shit! Your name's Gooper? Oh yeah. I don't believe a man named Gooper's ever killed anyone before. Oh, come on, give me a chance. I finally get to use Paul's shotgun. <sighs> All right, Gooper, go get her done. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh. Time to die. Marvin, it sounded like someone kicked the door in and said time to die. No, they didn't. You're just hearing things. No, she's not. Time to die. Please, no. Don't kill Jeffy, please. Oh, what? I'm getting paid a million dollars to do this shit. Any last words? Gibbity goggle fuck. He had the gun backwards. I don't think he's ever done this before. Is Jeffy dead? Where's the heart? No, Jeffy's not dead. Did you just see that? He was holding the gun what? the wrong way. I'm getting way. paid a million dollars to do this shit. Any last words? Gibbity goggle fuck. He had the gun backwards. I don't think Jeffy he's ever done this before. Is Jeffy dead? Where's the heart? No, Jeffy's not dead. Your assassin shot himself. God damn it, Gooper. Wait, why don't you just take his heart? Well, I don't want a heart from someone named Gooper. Hey, guys, I was looking at this x-ray, and it turns out that's not actually Goodman's heart. That's just a little heart sticker that my daughter put on the x-ray machine. You know what? No more bringing kids to work. Wait, what? so if that's not Goodman's heart, is his heart okay? Yeah, yeah, his heart's fine. But he had a heart attack. Well, I guess that was just how much shock he was in it, how much money she spent on that purse. Oh. Well, there's a dead body behind the couch if you want to get his heart. Yeah, his name's Gooper. What? Oh. Have you ever had surgery? Yeah, I had surgery on my neck to remove the tonsils in my throat when I was younger. It was a nice experience, it was. Not a nice experience at all, but have you ever had surgery? Let me know in the comments down below, but... After all of that, it turned out that Goodman didn't even... It was just one of those stickers, it was. Casual, casual, SML plot twist as usual. Wow. Just, 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 just wow. Just wow right there. So, Goodman just had a heart attack because he, because he was in shock of how much Rose brought, brought for that bag right there. And Goodman just hired that, that, that assassin for, for, for no reason right there. Well done, Goodman. Well done. So all that stress was for nothing, was for absolutely nothing. Yeah, that's all I basically all gotta say. I gotta say right there. If you do want to check out my previous uh, SMO SMG4 reactions? I'll have a playlist up in the top right corner of your screen right now. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button for me. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought of this SMO movie I reacted to. Also, let me know in the comments down below what other videos you want me to react to next. 
follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok. Links to both of them will be in the description down below. Share this video, subscribe if you're new here, ring that bell to get notified. When I upload new videos, when I post on the community tab, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!